Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Morgan. And I'm Brendan. And, and welcome, welcome to, to Bash, Bash TV. TV. Today is Friday, April 22nd, making today the official 153rd day of school and day one of the cycle. The lunch menu for today will be honey barbecue chicken tenders, corn, fruit, and milk. Breakfast menu for tomorrow will be cherry frutal, fruit, assorted juice, and milk. Prom tickets are on sale in the guidance office. Tickets are $40 and include a full dinner, which will be served at the ballroom plus your entrance to the dance immediately following dinner. The deadline to purchase prom tickets is Friday, May 6th. Students who would like to bring a guest from another school district to the prom must complete a guest pass and submit it to Mr. Bennett in the front office by Friday, May 6th. All guest passes must include a photo ID. Students with any of the following will not be permitted to purchase a prom ticket. They include six illegal slash unexcused absences in semester two, three discipline referrals in semester two, five days out of school suspension in semester two, any financial obligation to the high school slash junior district. Juniors, the Berlin's basket sale ends today. That's it for the main desk. Let's send it over to Sports with Tyrone. Thanks, Brendan and Morgan. I'm Tyrone. Let's take a look at everything that's going on with sports. On Wednesday in boys' track, Boric won 10 events with Damon Reed claiming the 100 and 200 win over Pittston in girls' track. Ali Malkiri was Boric's only two-time winner, claiming the discus and javelin throws. In varsity tennis, Brendan Tarowski picked up Boric's lone win 6-3 to, to 63 in number one singles in a 1-4 to four loss to Holmesdale. In boys vo volleyball, Graham Marshman had 15 digs in Berwick's 25-15, to 15, 25-15, 25-18 loss. Jaden Charles added two kills while Brock Seeley finished with seven digs. In varsity softball, Gabby Starr delivered a home run in a 11 to 1 win over Wilkes-Bear. Brooke Siegel, Nicole Yangzowski, and Peyton Lipsy, and Gina Berlin also contributed hits for Berwick. In the night sports, varsity baseball is home with Tuntanic at 4.15 p.m. Varsity softball is away with Hazleton at 4.15 p.m. Dismissal 2 p.m. Varsity Volleyball is away with North Pocono at 5 p.m. Dismissal 1.45 p.m. Varsity Golf is away with Ted Triba Tournament at home on Saturday. Junior High vest Varsity Basketball is home with Dallas at 11 a.m. Now over to Josh with FYI to see what's happening around BHS. Tyrone. I'm Josh. Let's get started with FYI. Applications for summer employment with the Berwick Area School District are available in the guidance office. Completed applications are due on April 29th. The YMCA has a volunteer opportunity available as a summer day camp counselor in training, CIT. As a summer camp CIT, you will inspire youth and foster enrichment in our community. Lead weekly adventures and outings all summer long and explore nature and all our beautiful area has to offer. Apply in person at the Berwick YMCA. Volunteers from the art club and cheerleaders are needed for West Berwick Elementary School Spring Carnival on May 13th from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. Interested students should sign up in the guidance office. 
Well, that's it for today's episode. To conclude, we'll leave you with the birthdays. Happy birthday over the weekend to Trace Bogart and McKenna Lombargo.